Oh, I know it. And the heat advisory continues for another day. Uh, we will likely see this be extended, but as of now, it's in place through the day today for heat index of 105 or higher. I'm expecting uh, really most of North Texas to be included in this again tomorrow and the day after. So that's one of the things that you need to know. The other thing is that we have Saharan dust that is moving in right now. Very, very light amounts, but you'll see a thicker plume as the day goes on. This is not going to be a wall of dirt or dust that you see. It's more so going to be more like a haze, but it may impact your allergies. It may feel like you're dealing with allergies. A heads up for today and tomorrow, and we have the potential for rain this weekend. It's not for everyone, but there is a small potential there. The temperature right now, Fair Park, 86 degrees, but it feels like 97. This is one of those cameras I'm going to look at uh, throughout the day for some of that haze because generally you can see it well against a, a skyline. Temperature at DFW of 88. It's not even noon. It already feels like 98. I'm expecting the heat index to be in the triple digits by one today. Wind is out of the south at 10 to 20, and that south wind is what's helping bring in not just the dust, but also the moisture in the area, which is why the humidity is high and why our heat index is so high. So about 95 degrees around two. the heat index by then at 103, 99 at four, the heat index at 105 and into the upper 80s by around 10. But look at the heat index still in the mid 90s because we have so much moisture, our temperatures just don't cool down much overnight. So today, 99 degrees expected for the high across Dallas, Fort Worth. If you don't make it to the triple digits today, you'll likely be there tomorrow or the next day. I mean, we're just seeing temperatures climb about a degree or two over the next few days. 101 on Thursday, 103 on Friday. That 103, by the way, the hottest temperature I have on the 14 day triple digits through early next week with the heat index anywhere between 104 to 107. Remember, the heat index is what it feels like for us when we step out. Normal high around this time of the year is about 97. OK, so like I mentioned, rain potential. It's slim, but it is there and it's likely for this weekend. Anywhere between a trace to a tenth of an inch. Some locations may see slightly higher amounts to the southwest because of a front stalling out. Let me show you what that looks like as we look across uh, Texas. We're seeing this right this front that comes in. This is showing you Saturday very early. Could see some added cloud cover Saturday afternoon. We start to see the scattered showers, maybe an isolated thunderstorm. I have about 20% coverage of rain in the forecast as of now. That front slows down the more south it moves and then eventually it stalls to the south of DFW. As it stalls, it keeps some of the rain chances in for us. Only about 10% coverage though on Sunday, and there's where we could see some higher rainfall totals is wherever that front stalls on Sunday. So we'll be watching that. Also watching the tropics right now. There's a tropical wave. It looks like it's getting its act together a bit better. And right now it's just a cluster of showers and thunderstorms, but eventually it's going to move into some warm waters and into an environment that could produce a tropical depression. So we'll be watching. This is the area of interest where we could see a tropical system over the next several days. Now this is more likely towards the end of the week and the weekend. No impacts to Texas. But if you're heading towards Florida or maybe somewhere along the southeast, definitely pay close attention to the forecast for us. Hot, dry the next couple of days. Morning lows in the upper 70s, triple digits for high temperatures as early as tomorrow. And we stay there through early parts of next week. Now, after, say, Thursday, Friday of next week, we could be only in the upper 90s, right? And that's as we approach the middle part of August. We'll be back.